Tesla Shanghai is constructing their third stamping shop. Is that for Model Y or Model 2? There has been a lot of discussion for that. Here, first, let's take a look. This is a picture from the latest video by Uwa showing the third stamping shop in construction. Stamping machine is very heavy, and they also have a very heavy mode moving up and, up and down at a very high uh, frequency. So that caused a lot of uh, dynamic impact on the ground. So it needs a very uh, big and special foundation. That's why you see a big pit here. That is the foundation. We can see three stamping shops in, uh, shop in this picture. The one on the most uh, right side is the Model 3 stamping shop. The middle one is the Model Y stamping shop. And the third one is the new stamping shop in construction. The UWAS video link is in the bottom of these slides. This picture shows the floor plan for phase one producing model three. Everything starts from the stamping shop and then goes to the body shop and then the paint shop and eventually go to the general assembly. They put all the jewelry inside and uh, you got a new car. This is the corresponding construction phase of the uh, phase one. The pit here is for Model 3 stamping shop. This picture was taken on April 1st, 20, 2019 uh, from Wuwa's video. Again, the link is here, the bottom of the slide. This is the finished view of the Model 3 stamping shop. You can see two sections here. This section is a storage section, and this section is the stamping section. This is the inner view of the stamping shop. This part is the stamping machine, and this is the storage section. So this shows the construction phase of the Model Y stamping shop. The picture was taken on April 3rd, 2020 from Uwa's video. Again, here the link is provided. The big pit is for Model Y stamping machine. And uh, this is the Model Y main production hall. And this, this structure and this window, this we believe this is the connection from the stamping shop to the main production hall. And uh, the parts will be conveyed from here through this window to the other side. This is the finished view of the model uh, Y stamping shop, you can see here. And this is the old model 3 stamping shop, and here's the connection. This is the main production hall of model Y. This is the model Y stamping machine in the assembly phase. It's not finished yet. This wall actually is the wall of the Model 3 stamping shop, and this direction is the north direction. This is another picture uh, taken on July 17th, 2020, when the crane, inside the crane, was installed. This is the Model Y stamping uh, machine inside of the stamping shop. A lot of people say the third stamping shop is for Model 2, the low-cost new model coming to Shanghai. So one machine for one model, that sounds very reasonable, right? However, if this were for Model 2, they will need a lot of trucks to transport parts uh, from here to the new location. That costs a lot of traffic, and uh, it's not an efficient way. It's good to have a stamping shop connect to the main production facilities. Pay attention to the current Model Y uh, stamping shop. It has a connection to the main facility of the Model Y. And pay attention to this new building and this small structure. It is possible to be the second connection to the, to the main facility of the Model Y. If this is true, why Model Y needs two stamping machines while well, Model 3 only needs one? We saw inside of this building. There's only one machine. This is a very inter interesting question. 
I believe Model Y facility in Shanghai may have a higher design capacity than the Model 3. As a reference, uh, Model 1 reached 5,700 units per week in last year, November. That is uh, 300,000 units per year. Shanghai Model Y might have a higher target than this number, more than 300,000 units per year.